have less than a kilometer of distance to go. It shows 900 meters along the trail to the top. And we're at about 1,450 meters right now. The top is 1,788. So we still have another 340, 350 meters to go elevation-wise over the next kilometer. And we've now reached the House Sound Crest Trail, which comes along right here, crosses over and heads down that way. We continue up there. Got a bunch of signs up there. You are not lost, I think is what they're saying. Heading up the ridge to that, and then crossing over to the main summit just beyond. now just over 100 meters elevation to gain it's opened up quite nicely here down over there I believe it's Mount Harvey there's Bowen Island okay so we've just come up top of a little saddle here there's kind of a sub peak of Brunswick looking over that way you can see way in the distance black tusk I do believe that the one that we can see just to the left of the black tusk is Mount Windsor and uh, just hidden out of sight should be Deke's Peak you got Goat Ridge with Garibaldi behind it co-pilot Sky Pilot, The Ledge, uh, and I do believe to the right of that is uh, Mount Capilano, where I was yesterday. Hanover, right there. Down there is Brunswick Lake, and here's what we're going to be doing. Heading up there. So we go up this ridge. Just be following that, scrambling up and over along. We are at uh, 1,720 meters. The summit is 1788.
I think we're here. to add a little bit more to the day. What we're gonna do is we're gonna drop down to the House Sound Crest Trail and then we're gonna traverse along that and to Mount Harvey over there. We're gonna climb up Mount Harvey and then descend the Mount Harvey Trail back to Lions Bay. It adds just an extra couple of kilometers to the day, two to three kilometers and um, about 300 odd meters of elevation gain to the entire day. So that's not so bad. For now, we keep going. It's up, it's down, it's rocky, it's rooty. Steep, doesn't it? How does it get down the other side? Well, that's what I'm really wondering. That's supposedly the thing we're going up. There's Brunswick. They were up there just a little while ago. Now we're hoping to go up there. Looks kind of steep. We shall see. We have reached the turn off from the House Sound Crest Trail to join Mount Harvey. House Sound Crest Trail continues over the top of the saddle there. We are going to drop down here, head that way, and then on to the summit. Over there is the hut. Just make out a little bit of orange behind the tree. And now, steeply, steeply up here. This, uh, this side of Mount Harvey, I don't think gets as much use as the other side coming from Lions Bay. The connector between House Sound Crest Trail and the uh, summit. Much less use, very steep. There's the feet. There's the steep. So we're on top of Mount Harvey now. That's uh, Mount Brunswick over there. Well, it's 4.07 and we're about to start heading down. Would love to stay up here till it got dark, but not really an option, unfortunately. Based on the current time, it's uh, it's probably going to be dark walking down the road. We'll probably have have full dark right around the time we get back to the cars.
So we come over the top, we're gonna head down the other side. So it's 5.35, we've been descending now for an hour and a half. We're alongside Alberta Creek right now. And this is a very steep section down along a rib that's right beside the creek here. We're down to 760 meters elevation which means we have another 530 meters to descend. The strangest, strangest rope ever. Don't know what it's here for but it's here and it's embedded in the trees. It's like it's, you know, tied around the tree and then the tree's just grown around it. Getting darker now. We're getting there. And here we are, it's quarter to six now. Sun's just about down and we are on the road. There's the bottom of our trail right there. Just get down to here. We're 650 meters elevation now means we have another 420 to go.